hi guys in today's video i will do a detailed review about the soil sensor also uh, i'll tell you how to integrate it with arduino uno board again if you are not available in your home i'll also tell how to feed water to your plants in the home so all this in the single video so stay connected and watch the video till the end first i will describe how the soil sensor works so soil sensor have three uh, components uh, first uh, of course the soil sensor a terminal then the sensor part then the, you have the set of wires now what you have to do you have to connect the sensor uh, terminals the two terminals with the main sensor uh, two terminals another side have three terminals that is vcc ground analog pin so analog pin you have to connect to the analog pins pin of the arduino uno board what happen uh, when you keep the soil sensor two terminals inside the soil it will check the conductivity it will actually checks the open circuit voltage across the two terminals if the think if the soil is dry condition the conductivity will be zero see open terminal voltage will be very very high means maximum so if the open circuit voltage is maximum so what it will do it will convert that maximum voltage to the corresponding digital value and give it to the arduino uno board the maximum value is 1024 in digital so if think water is given to the soil so soil become wet and the conductivity started and also the open circuit voltage decreases after a certain value the soil is fully wet so we have to do the testing and all at what value the soil will be the in wet condition and we have to program it accordingly now moving to the circuit section as you can see the soil sensor two terminals will be connected to this soil inside the soil and it has a an, uh, analog pin vcc and ground the analog pin will connected to the a not of the arduino uno board similarly vcc will be connected to 5 volt and ground to ground again i am declaring the 10th pin as the output pin of the arduino uno board and i am giving to 5 volt relay module guys if you don't know how to work with relay modules and all please go and check in the link uh, in the description how to work with relays then come back over here now uh, the common of the 5 volt relay is given with the 5 volt supply and the normally open is connected to the positive of the pump uh, so uh, and the negative of the pump is connected to the plus 5 volt ground okay that's all for the um, circuit section let's move to the programming part so before going to program section i would like to tell you that uh, the immersive pump that we, we are going to use to pump the water to the plants in your house you have to always immerse this pump in the water and also remember if it is immersing inside a tank or a bucket the water should always be available otherwise the windings of the pump may get damaged so guys please do take care about it and always try to pour water in the bucket where you are going to keep this pump now moving to the program section i have de take declaring a variable called soil and also a uh, a not value will be taken or uh, given to the soil variable also the output pin is 10 declaring variable as pump and soil value va variable so that it will uh, take the value of the uh, digital soil value Uh, the digital soil value as i have described earlier in the video it will store the digital value of the voltage open circuit voltage from the sensor now in the next section as you can see serial dot begin for the serial monitor declaring the baud rate and declaring the pump variable as the output pin 
now taking in the loop section soil value i am taking the soil value if it is more than 850 then pump will be on or off if you don't know why i am giving low in the pump zero is low guys in the arduino programming zero one can be written as low or high now i am giving 850 so if the values goes above 850 so it is more like dry condition we have to switch on the pump so while you are uh, while you are doing the testing you can change it as per your convenience now i think so program part is over now if you have any doubts please do implement this project in your home if you have a kind of doubt ask me in the comment section also the program is available in my personal web page uh, the link is given in the description please guys do like and subscribe my channel for more such videos